The video game Kingdom Come Deliverance 2 was just released and it was accompanied by an incredible CGI trailer made by the incredibly talented people over at Plattage Image. Now in this CGI trailer, they use a very interesting camera technique called the Snorri Cam. This is a device that attaches the camera to your actor and it sticks it out right in front of them that gives this kind of disorienting point of view. Now Plattage Image did use motion capture and they attached the virtual camera to their actor for some of the shots, but what if you don't have access to all of that? Well today I'm going to show Show you how to easily recreate the snorri cam effect in unreal engine in only a few steps first we're going to need some animation to apply to our character so head over to mixamo and find any kind of walking animation i'm going to choose this drunk walking animation and i'm going to export that out as an fbx next i'm going to head over to unreal engine i'm going to load up a scene and i'm going to import a metahuman now we need to import the animation we just got from mixamo so drag the fbx into your content browser and make sure that the skeleton is empty this will make sure to import the mixamo skeleton now that we have an animation sequence created we now need to right click on it and click retarget animations. Now we need to choose the body skeletal mesh that our metahuman is using and retarget that animation to it. So now we can create a new sequence, drag in our metahuman and we can delete the control rigs. Now on the body, click the plus sign, go to animation and click on the animation that we just retargeted and boom, we've got a drunk metahuman, but now we need to get a camera attached to him. So let's create a camera. I'm just gonna choose the DSLR film back preset and I'm gonna set it to the 12 millimeter preset because typically on a snorri cam rig, when you mount a camera in front of somebody, it's so close to them that you have to use a wide angle lens. So now here's the most important part to really achieve this effect. We need to bring the camera into our sequence, click the plus button and click attach, and we need to choose the metahuman blueprint. This will now bring up a prompt of where you want to attach the camera to. And then I chose torso and then I chose pelvis because if you look at a snorri cam rig, it is typically mounted at the pelvic region. And when you do this, your camera is going to disappear and all you need to do is zero out the transform controls for the camera and that will then center it at the pelvis of the metahuman. Now all you need to do is offset the camera by moving it away from the metahuman, fixing the rotation, and getting it at an angle where it's kind of looking up at the face of the metahuman. And now when you hit play, you should have a camera that is attached to the body of your metahuman, and it will follow them wherever they go. Uh -huh. 